Hi, it's Master Wolf one two one two. Um, by request, um, on one of my videos, eighteen was of steel bus, uh, eighteen was of steel hall in Volvo bus mod. I had a request by one of uh, my watchers, uh, to make a video on how to install the bus mod or any mods for games. Now, it's different on different games. This, the way I'm installing it, is only for eighteen was of steel hall. It may not work on on other ones like Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. So if you're looking for uh, how to install mods for other games in H1 Will Steal Holland, um, I don't. I'm not really sure. I'm. Sh I know how to, but this video's not for it. So first off, to get the mod, you want to go to Internet Explorer or any or any um, internet place you have AOL or whatever. Then I have it in my favorites, but just so you know um it's um it, it it's at uh http colon forward slash forward slash home dot d e d s dot n l forward slash um equivalent sign equality f forward slash downloads dot h t m l alright um now that you're at your a t m l still holland you want to go to Holland Mods. Not anything else but Holland Mods. And as you scroll down, you should come across something that says Bus Mod 1.0 by Slawmazer. Now, don't worry, this is not malware, malware. I've already downloaded this onto my computer. Then click on the first one that says Bus Mod 1.0 by Slawmazer.rar. Now, if you want to download this, if you want this on your game, you know you want to know how to do uh, zip uh working if you don't you uh this this video will show you how so f uh obviously you want to click on down download file i already have it downloaded so um i i already have it downloaded so what i'm going to do is i'm going to guide you through the download first once you download it now I don't know what type of operating system you have, so it may be a little different. Anyways, you want to go to Documents. Then, um, you want to make, you want to find it. Uh, I kind of separated it off so it would go to Downloads. It should go in Downloads. And then it says RAR uh, Bus Mod 1.0 by Slaw Moss. Now here's the thing. When I do my zips, I use something called uh, All Zip, as you can see here. If you don't have All Zip, then double click on double click on your Internet Explorer, or if you have Windows Vista, to do that. And right now, I'm going to type in uh, uh, second, and then you should come across All Zip. Um, you don't really, um, there, there's other ways, but I only know how to use it like this. You double click, okay? Now, this is already done, so it's a little different, okay? I have my all zip stuff. It's, uh, I, it might be a little different. I'll give you the link where to get this all zip, in fact. Um, just if you want to know the uh, where you where you can get this download, just look in the um, in the video descri description, and I'll make sure to add it. And you just gotta click on that link, and it will bring it. It's free download, so uh, no pay. It is I I promise you. They and you can leave a a comment on me if it happens. The, this is not a virus, not malware, nothing bad. This is actually just like downloading something you paid for. I, I, I've even checked. I've went through a lot of um, checks for this. So, once you get to it, I'm going to show you how to use it on all zip. Double click on this Bus Mod 1.0 by Slaw Mazer. Okay? If you already have it, it uh, well, if you've already put it in, you want to go to readme.txt. That stands for text. All right, and then it will give you the README. It's quite simple. It usually seems like it's not simple, all right? Now, this mod also gives you new cars, so it'll show you all this. But really, installation. Right here, it should say installation. That's what you're going to read. 
Okay. Um. So it it says here. Um. A file bus mod v1 dot ses to put in a folder mod. All right. So that seems kind of confusing, doesn't it? But if you can understand this, so what they're saying is, you see, right here it says bus mod v1 dot ses. And then when you read, go to the readme.txt, guess what it says? A file bus mod v1 dot ses put in a folder mod. So then, without closing anything, you go to the um, your 18 wheels of steel Holland thing, uh, Holland, uh, what do you call it? Folder. And then it'll bring you with all your folders. You can see right on the top how I have it, it says mod. It's not that clear, but it says mod right here. Keyword. Nothing nothing more. It's like the most simple thing ever. It says mod. I didn't even make that folder. It comes with the game. Like the game already knows you're gonna be putting mods in it. So you press mod, you double click. I already have it installed. But you are gonna drag the bus mod b one dot SES down into your um folder bus mod, wherever you want. And that's all you have to do. Then I recommend, and it, it probably won't even work if you don't, you restart your computer. It's a classic thing um, that they prove that it helps computers remember all its data, and it's best that you, um, that you do that. And then, when uh, I have this special cool thing, you go back, you double click, and you should have your bus mod. Um, so, if you, I'm going to go over this one more time, just so you know. First, you, you go to um, Internet Explorer. You go to the website that I provided. You download it. Then, after you download it, you go, if you don't, you have to um, go to your documents. Then click on, on uh, you should find it in your download section. Then double click. And it should say busmod b one dot r i r. It's an r i r file. Then it should bring you to this. You get the readme text. Then you read until it says installation. A file busmod v one dot s e s to put in a folder mod. You do that. And then you find this. It says right there. Then you open up your You open up your folder and that, and you just simply drag the bus mod B1. That's it. If you have any questions, just leave a uh, comment. I tried to make uh, me speak as slow as I can, so I hope this helped. Thanks for watching, and good luck.